Hello, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back with episode 3, and things are exciting. In that, I may not need a lander after all. I managed to get the thing off the ground after hours of just trying different things. And, as it turns out, the answer was to simply drain the fuel tank. And hopefully leave myself enough t left to, uh, get back to Kerbin. But we'll have to see. As you can see, we have almost no RCS fuel and almost no rocket fuel. So I am trying to conserve it as we attempt to escape Minmus. Again, there is no SAS on board, so I have to command this manually. Alright, we're looking good. Started with about 5,500 5, 5, liters. So... Here's hoping we don't need that much. Almost out there. Ah, oh boy. Gotta try. Come on. Escape already. Two hundred and eighty seven liters. Gonna be a tough, tough thing to do. Should it escape momentarily? Shouldn't we? Uh, I have no idea what the actual escape point is. And it's got to shoot out soon. I really have no idea where the escape point is. I guess it's over 2 million, though. 286 liters of fuel, okay. Oops, shoot, 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 shoot. Okay, so it worked. Step one is complete. And now step two for the waiting game. I mean, it doesn't bloody well matter. We have to wait until we're at the apoapsis to do anything. Still seven hours out, okay. Thirty minutes. Fifteen minutes. Ten minutes. Six, five, four, three, two. All right, so just a couple of seconds out of our apoapsis now. This is the exact moment when I need to give everything I've got into retrograd and try and bring my periapsis down just enough. Give me 30% engine power. Give 
Give me RCS as well. Alright, so we're getting in there. This is working. Let's burn off all of our RCS fuel first. Doing this, this is... Let's conserve the rocket fuel. I can get my orbital speed down this way at least. Even if only a few meters a second. Alright, we're out. Okay. So we have no more RCS fuel. Yep, WAPS is still 13 mil. Suppose ultimately all I have to do is hope the uh, rocket fuel lasts long enough. It should, it should. Oh, it's gotta. It has gotta. Full power, everything I've got. We're on a return trajectory, everybody. We're on a freaking return trajectory. It's a good thing, too. Apparently we'd have a Minimus encounter next time we went around. Alright, so we're getting somewhere now. We've just barely managed to escape Minimus. I can't help but, uh, you know, autosave yet again. Or, not autosave, quick save. Cause God knows I'll find a way to mince up this landing. Alright. So, we have yet to enter the atmosphere, but it won't be long. So, as a final gesture of everything, burn off the remaining rocket fuel and jettison. Slower descent as much as possible. Every little bit helps. It's not like we're coming in on a decent angle here. Looks like the rescue mission is not necessary. 60, 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. Alright, we're out of fuel. Alright, let's begin spinning the rocket then. Let's see if I can't truck myself over this ocean. Hey, there we go. Hopefully, gonna land on the ocean. And, yeah. So, we are, in fact, now in the atmosphere. We need... Whoop, 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 whoop. We need to be facing top of the pod up, so we can deploy the parachute when necessary. On drag shoot work. Thank goodness the atmosphere is awesome. It's like a giant landing cushion. Da 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 da. We have. I repeat, we have actually managed to bring these guys back without sending like a rescue mission or something. I I am just flabbergasted. Like I said, I wasn't even planning on getting it off. I was just kind of, like, seeing. Well, okay, I was planning that it would eventually lift off, but I never thought we'd actually have enough fuel left to make it back. Oh, my God. I just...
Well. Ah, oh boy. Everybody lives. I'm just astounded now. Turns out everything worked out. I honestly thought everyone was doomed. <laughs> I honestly thought this would be an entire failure. Turns out I was wrong. And you know what? I'm happy to be wrong. So with great pleasure, I say that the Kerman, the Kerman brothers here are rescued. And I fulfilled my oath to get them back home. So, I guess there's only one thing left to say. <laughs> Until next time, this is Kelvin signing off. <laughs>